so welcome back to my channel, Encourage Your Science. Okay, uh, if you remember, the last time we had was uh, lesson number 20, and we had to be challenged to make our own sequences for Kali, okay? And uh, we had an example on how we did it, okay? If you recall, the last time we had, I went through how I do the sequences. And there, I mentioned that the first thing to think about is the pattern to use. Okay, we can mix up and use any of the patterns, but we're taking it one by one. And the last time I sh I showed you that we used the kuros, the basic. Then we had the bolo spin, and of course the scratch the back. It's our basic. This time I'm going to show you how uh, to use another pattern called the triangle pattern. And, and if you are not familiar with it, and uh, you are just new to this, you can go back. Uh, we have 20 lessons already, and you can go back to my videos and post uh, showing you how the patterns are okay so here it comes let me describe it one by one and so you may be able to follow me okay and i'll do this slowly so this is a sequence and uh this is an impromptu i never thought about any but let me show you if i did a sequence made up of triangle patterns this would be how it would look like okay start with our standard ready position, fighting position, which is of course the boxing position, okay, and we have the weapon on our strong hand. To contrast it, if you are using the harness or the sword, the fencing stance, it would be the opposite. Okay, the front is the weapon, the, front, the leg is uh, the side of the weapon. But in Kali, we use this as the first ready position, okay. So the first move I would choose would be what we call as the uh, classic Kali illustration mode uh, defense offense, which is actually avoidance of the strike using a backward backward move and a, and a sequential slash hitting the wrist, hitting the arms. Okay, and here we use the side of the triangle. It's one side. Okay, and then we counter it with another thrust, the okay, thrust, and an advance using the other side of the triangle with another slash. Okay. And then we continue on with a thrust on the lower angle of the triangle, a slash on the lower base of the triangle, and another thrust on the other angle of the triangle. Then we do a slash, following the side of the triangle, another slash, and a thrust in the apex, and a slash. Okay, downward. Okay, now we change position. So how do we? So how do we change position? We mentioned the first time is that when you do a sequence, it, try to do it with symmetry. Meaning if you do it here, you may also do it back. So the transition will be this, okay? After this, we parry, bringing the weapon to the back, using the scratch to the back, okay? And then going to the other side, we do a cross leg, okay? Cross leg, and return backhand to, the pitch to strike another one, okay? Strike another one. Then use the side of the triangle, side of the triangle, thrust, and you swing it. Going to the other side. So there's the transition. Okay? Then you start with a position to transfer. Okay? Here we have the red position again. Scratch the back position. Then you do the Kali distressible defense open move with the back and the corresponding strike to the arm. And there we are. We start it again on this side. Okay? So we trust, we move forward with the slash, trust on one angle, slash on the towards another side, and another angle, trust, okay, here we are, okay. then we carry, okay, then we move it here, and then we do a 360 degree turn, and strike, okay. and we do this in the same manner. Then we swing, facing, and then we end up with this stance. Okay? So, let's try it. Okay? So, the first is, okay, this is the first move. Then we have a defense offense. Okay? 